Hi there folks, this is ButcherBird44 and I wanted to make a quick tutorial on how to make the um, BLK files so that uh, your skins will work. Um, now I have a custom skin here, it's for the F6, F5, but let's say that I want to make it work on the F65N okay now I can make that work so let's get it here and I'll show you what to do so we have it here we go to customization uh, we hit that so that it puts a a template skin in our files okay and Let's see. Let's see, here's the template. Here's the BLK file. Here's what I do. I right click, I copy it, I go back, and then I go to my custom skin. I drop it in here, okay? I paste it. Okay, so now I have it in my custom skin folder. Now, what's important to remember is, is that this is the name of my file, okay? So this is what I want to copy just for this example. Um, they'll all be different. Whatever the name of your skin is, is fine, okay? And you usually have it as one or the other from whatever, okay? And so the BLK file tells the game to look for this skin, and so that's what we're gonna edit what I use is notepad okay plus plus I think there's even a Mac version okay and then this is what it's saying the game is gonna default to this skin okay and what you wanna do is give it the other skin highlight that paste that in okay and then save it as and then refresh here and then bam it's right here oh actually I did that backwards I did a damage file see and it'll basically tell the game that the skin you want to use is exactly that so it will switch with whatever so here let's look at the BLK I have for this so F65 late blue 1944 a is the game um, what the game skin is named okay and I want to have it changed to F6F 3 USCDDS okay that's my normal file that I'm gonna use so what I do is go to this file I would paste it in between the quotes file save and then let's give it another try BAM and now I have it working on this okay but you see the shininess is off okay this means that the end file is defaulting to the normal okay and uh, to get that working I have to do the next one okay the end file is a spectral map so I want to look at see what I made it work on this one so I made it go to F6F3 USNDDS because my skin's a DDS okay so that has to be specific to whatever uh, to whatever the file is that you did the skin with okay so let me go to this and then I will change this second line to that file save let's see if we get the appropriate shininess yep see that and then I can use that on that 
Same way with the damage. You just copy and paste those two. And this is also where you add, let's say that you want the game to use a different cockpit. Okay, this is the same place that you add those lines to. Uh, make sure that, the, that there's a space here. Um, and you can do that with anything like the, uh, the bombs or any of the game files that you don't texture. Okay, that just about wraps it up. Um, I think that you could use Notepad as well that just comes on your Windows computer, but I would get this Notepad++. It's free, uh, so there's no, you know, there, there's generally not a problem with um, and I will include this link. Let me go here while I'm here. Let's see. Okay, well, I'll include this. Uh, thanks for watching. Good luck.